What is majority and minority charge carriers? Majority and minority charge carriers definition. The charge carriers that are present in large quantity are called majority charge carriers. The majority charge carrier carry most of the electric charge or electric current in the semiconductor. Hence, majority charge carriers are responsible for electric current flow in the semiconductor. The charge carriers that are present in small quantity are called minority charge carriers. The minority charge carriers carry very small amount of electric charge or electric current in the semiconductor. Charge carriers in intrinsic semiconductor. The semiconductors that are in pure form are called intrinsic semiconductors. In intrinsic semiconductor, the total number of negative charge carries free electrons is equal to the total number of positive charge carriers, holes or vacancy. Total negative charge carriers is equal to total positive charge carriers. Majority and minority charge carriers in n-type semiconductor. When the pentavalent atoms such as phosphorus or arsenic are added to the intrinsic semiconductor, an n-type semiconductor is formed. In n-type semiconductor, large number of free electrons is present. Hence, free electrons are the majority charge carriers in the n-type semiconductor. The free electrons, majority charge carriers, carry most of the electric charge or electric current in the n-type semiconductor. In n-type semiconductor, very small number of holes is present. Hence, holes are the minority charge carriers in the n-type semiconductor. The holes. Minority charge carriers carry only a small amount of electric charge or electric current in the n-type semiconductor. The total number of negative charge carriers, free electrons, in n-type semiconductor is greater than the total number of positive charge carrier holes in the n-type semiconductor. So, total negative charge carriers is greater than total positive charge carriers. Now let's look into majority and minority charge carriers in p-type semiconductor. When the trivalent atoms such as boron or gallium are added to the intrinsic semiconductor, a p-type semiconductor is formed. In p-type semiconductor, large number of holes is present. Hence, holes are the majority charge carriers in the p-type semiconductor. The holes, majority charge carriers, carry most of the electric charge or electric current in the p-type semiconductor. In p-type semiconductor, very small number of free electrons is present. Hence, free electrons are the minority charge carriers in the p-type semiconductor. The free electrons, minority charge carriers, carry only a small amount of electric current in the p-type semiconductor. The total number of negative charge carries free electrons in p-type semiconductor is less than the total number of positive charge carries holes in the p-type semiconductor. So, total negative charge carriers is lesser than total positive charge carriers.